so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, I can't believe that we already have a house. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Mila here. I hope you're all having an awesome day. And welcome back to Cinnamon Island. Okay, I know, I know, we already have a house and all. So let's go back in time a little bit. So today is technically, I think, official day three on Cinnamon Island. I haven't been up to anything too special like as probably most of you know the beginning of the game is quite slow paced and to be honest i've been enjoying it a lot i've been honestly just running around the island picking up some weeds um catching some bugs and fish and stuff like that so nothing too crazy but yeah as most of you know i don't restart my island really that often Oh, if you're new here, yes, we started a new island last week. Um, yeah, I don't do that very often, so I have completely, absolutely forgotten everything that happens in the beginning of the game, and I love it. I've been enjoying restarting this island. And yeah, I haven't been up to anything too special. Um, the only thing I did yesterday was, obviously, like, uh, I started the Blathers quest, so I caught, like, the five bugs that you need. I placed down his tent, and today he is here. And also, obviously, the elephant in the room, which is the house. We already have a house, oh my goodness. We are knees deep in loans. And yeah, let's see what we can get done today, shall we? Oh my goodness. Honestly, like, I just love the beginning of the game. I feel like I have, like, so many things to do, but at the same time... I don't have a lot to do and it's amazing so yeah let's see what we have in our mail and i have to say i freaking love the yellow roof our house looks so cute and it looks so good with rudy's house next to us oh i forgot that i actually did some nook shopping as well apparently we have a housewarming gift oh we have even something for jack our island is like really in the beginning so i'm not sure if we're gonna actually be able to do like a halloween event around the island we shall see maybe we'll ha celebrate halloween together let's see let's check the house i've been trying to buy every decoration that i've seen and shoot down every balloon in hopes of getting some items oh my goodness um so yeah this is our little house uh it's nothing too crazy just yet as you can see okay cute we need some like wallpaper some flooring our outfit is still a little bit rough but as you can see i have new pair of trousers but they're literally the same color as the starter stuff oh gulliver is here oh yeah, deirdre's house this brings me so much happiness like honestly just seeing deirdre walking around the island I'm just so happy she's back. Okay, so let's go and see what Blathers is up to. Oh yeah, I've been already stacking up on all the bugs and fish to donate to him because this time around I do want to complete the museum or at least, at least as much as I can. <laughs> yes, that is me. I chose this wonderful location for you. Oh yeah, maybe we can get the shovel finally. Oh, okay, vaulting pole first. As you can see, I remember nothing. Like, I remember nothing. Yes, okay, we can like finally actually completely, truly, madly, deeply explore this island. So yeah, I've been stacking up on some bugs and fish. And yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna have this island for one full year, but I want to do my very best and try to complete the Critterpedia and the museum. Um, yeah, in my previous island, I did not even get Blathers out of his tent because I wanted to do like this whatever design with his tent. But to be honest, like if you do not complete your museum, you are missing out on so much content in the game that this time around we will for sure have the museum. I have like one week left of October and I have so many bugs and fish to catch that are like October only. So I want to work on that for sure. But yeah, the main things that I've been up to is like trying to clean this side of the island 
I've been gathering some material and stuff. As you can see, I just threw them all on the floor because... Well, we didn't really have enough storage space. What is up, Tommy? I'm so happy seeing him outside. Oh, thank you! We are like progressing so fast. Like we literally spent like two nights in the tent and we already have a home. Oh, I really like the yellow roof. It's so cute. I mean, this like the first house is so adorable. <laughs> it's so small and cute. And I love how my villagers also have the homes now. Yeah, I was actually thinking not to rush and like not to have the house this quickly. But also like you don't really have storage if you don't build the house, so that's also the other point. I even have a house now! Rudy is so cute, honestly. He's also the perfect fall villager. Ignoring Gulliver. What is up, DJ? Big news! I've officially moved on from the tent life. Oh my goodness, girl. I cannot wait to decorate your house. The recipe house are so ugly. <laughs> Alrighties, let's see what Gulliver is up to. Honestly, I feel like on my first time playing Animal Crossing, it took me like a week before I saw Gulliver on my island. I can't believe he's already here on day three. Yes, well, hello, sir. Did you by any chance fell off your boat? But also, how am I supposed to dig up his handy dandy pieces from the sand. I don't have a shovel. How am I supposed to do that? Yeah, in case it's not obvious, uh, I really want to like take it very easy on this island and I haven't helped myself out from my other island. So yeah, I don't have a shovel or anything and yeah, I'm not sure if I want to like bring over any stuff in the beginning of the game. Like I just want to take it real easy. Okay, Tom, what is up? Since the number of homeowners is increasing, we need to build a shop. Oh my goodness. <gasps> okay, I think day three is kind of lit. There is like so many things to do. Happy with your home? Yes, I'm so happy to have this crazy loan that's going to be a bit of a struggle. Happy Home Academy? Okay. Oh, I didn't even check what we got in the mail. What is like the the home warming gift? Oh my goodness. Um, Can I pay Miles? <laughs> okay. I'm so happy to owe you all this money. <gasps> Nook Mile tickets, you guys. Loki also very excited to do our first villager hunt and stuff. Okay, 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 okay. Anything else? Okay, 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 okay. So yesterday was like the blathers quest. Today is more like focused on getting the shop done. Let's build a shop. Yes, we need some furniture. Okay, I think the iron nuggets are gonna be the only thing that is gonna be probably a bit of a struggle. Let's see if we can get everything done today. But yeah, I've been really enjoying just taking things slow and yeah, just enjoying the beginning of the game. I just find it so relaxing. Yeah, I don't really want to rush it because, you know, once you've done with all this beginning stuff, you can never get it back. <laughs> What's up, Deidre? I heard you were getting stuff together for the shop. That is right. Please give us some iron nuggets. Oh. Shovel. Oh my goodness. Like, I honestly don't even... I thought we get the shovel from Blathers for some reason. That is really funny. Thank you, Deidre. <laughs> Why have I forgotten literally everything? I mean, to be fair... Last time I restarted my island was like two years ago or something. And I do try to avoid watching like the beginning of the game because I kind of like it when I forget the beginning. Yeah, like when you forget everything, it feels like you're kind of a new player experiencing the game from scratch. So yeah, I feel so overwhelmed right now. You know, like the first two days is like so peaceful and you only have like this small 
a lot of land to look after. Like, now I feel like we have, like, so many things to do. Oh, was this the the housewarming gift? Alrighties. Random. So I did farm up some wood yesterday. So I guess we can go and donate all these things to the boys. But yeah, the iron nuggets are definitely gonna be a bit of a headache. Especially if I don't want to help myself out from my other account. I'd like to donate. These are for you. Oh, awesome. Okay, I also want to check Nook Shopping. Let's see if there is like some cute items here. Okay, nothing too crazy. Yeah, I think in the beginning of the game it's good to just like buy whatever items you can and just throw them around the island because it will help you to get to three stars like as quickly as possible. Honestly, I also want to farm some Nook Miles so I can buy like bigger pocket space because the small pockets are driving me crazy. Okay, let's see how this one looks like. Oh, that's actually really cute. I like that. Kind of goes with our yellow theme. Like, I don't know, for some, some reason we have like this yellow theme going on on the island. What about this one? Okay, that's kind of... Not the vibe, to be honest. Let's just keep this one for now. We can put a cute little portrait on the wall. Oh my god, our house looks so random right now. <laughs> but yeah, also placing stuff inside and outside helps you to get miles. So yeah, highly recommended for the first days. Okay, I really like the wallpaper. Just gonna bring a rest of this stuff also inside. So our island doesn't look like a junkyard. I think we need like 5,000 miles to expand our pockets. Oh, we're almost there. Nice. Okay. So I think I'm gonna farm up my rocks. Let's see how many iron nuggets can we get from our island. The amazing thing is that... Okay, that's not gonna work out. I'm afraid that I will initiate a conversation and not be able to like farm the whole <laughs> farm the whole rock. Every iron nugget is precious. But yeah, the good thing is that I mean, right now we can obviously access the whole island, but on this side, oh my god, did it really give me just one iron nugget? Like seriously? As I was saying, this little initial part of the island actually has four rocks on it so that's pretty awesome i like when you can access them like really early in the game but wow these are really not giving us any iron nuggets huh it's always the iron nuggets isn't it let's see if we can even like get this um shop quest completed today and now that I'm talking about the rocks, I can't even find them. Oh my god, Deirdre, like, can you just, like, go away for a second? <laughs> Why does she have to, like, hang out next to the rock? Okay, one... Two... Okay. Was that really it? Oh, there's one behind the museum. And this is the money rock, of course. I mean, we do also need those bells to pay off these loans. But yeah, as I've mentioned probably way too many times now, I really, really, really want to take it really slow in the beginning. Like, I'm not going to rush any of these quests or anything. I really want to enjoy the beginning of the island life. So I think we're going to progress quite slowly. I'm gonna probably kind of combine some of the first days in these videos because yeah, right now I can probably post like one video per week and if we would progress like day by day, it would be really, really slow. So that's kind of the plan. I know a lot of you also mentioned in the comments of last week's video that you guys were restarting your islands or you have restarted just recently so let me know in the comments how you're progressing are you taking it easy or are you trying to speed run through to three stars let me know 
I don't know, I just love restarting an island. It's just so relaxing and fun and there is like so many things to do. Okay, pocket space. I am going to invest in this one. I also do want to get the better tools. Like, I think that's our next priority. Yeah, this is essential. <laughs> okay, we need 3,000 for that. I would also like to try making some custom designs. I've never ever <laughs> created anything other than this beautiful face paint that I'm wearing right now. So that could be fun as well. So many things to do. Okay, oh, right, 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 right. I wanted to make a vaulting pole, farm those two remaining rocks and this one. Ooh, golden nugget! No way! Why are we literally getting everything else except <laughs> the iron nuggets? I have eight so far. Oh my god. I have to rethink my decisions. Do I just want to like come and drop off some iron nuggets from my other island maybe? I really want a cuter outfit as well. Okay, let's find our two rocks. Also, let's go and check out that like secret, not secret beach. This is like one of my favorite aspects of this map. Like you can access the secret beach without a ladder, without anything. This is so cool. I definitely want to keep this part of the island like kind of as it is. I'm not going to terraform. I want to like build the designs around this aspect because I think that's such a cool thing about this map. I actually like you probably noticed in last week's video that I really didn't even pay attention to that because I wasn't thinking that I'm going to take this map. Like I didn't really pay that much attention to the details in this map because I was like, yeah, you know, let's just go check it out. It's probably nothing special. And then we ended up going with this map anyways. But yeah, I really, really like this map. And we obviously don't have a ladder. What am I even doing with my life? Okay, let's see. Okay, I see. One of the rocks is up there. Um, Yeah, one thing that I also noticed is that this island has the short pier. But that doesn't really bother me. Because to be honest, like I'm always like, oh... It would be nice to have like the longer pier so I can use it like in a build or something. And I never end up doing anything with it. Like I never build anything fantastic or I don't decorate it in any kind of special way. So I think me personally, I'm okay with the shorter pier. Okay, at least we found one more rock. Please give us all the iron nuggies that we need. Okay, yes, this one looks better. <laughs> And at least we literally get nook miles from everything that we do. Yay, we discovered our first fossil. Let's take it to Blathers. And also, can we just appreciate like the beginning music? I think that's like my favorite aspect of the game. I, I feel like it would be so nice if we would have like an option to have this music like in the end game as well. I know there is like the music per hour thing, but I just find the beginning music so much more relaxing. Yes, Blathers, I have our first fossil for you. Yes. Ooh. Okay, 14 more donations and we can get our museum going. I have a ton of things outside, but I'm not gonna bore you guys to death by donating all of this today. Besides, it's not 14, so I still need to do some fishing and stuff. Okay, guys, I think <clears throat> just out of curiosity and to kind of make this episode a bit spicy, let's go to Anuk My Island, shall we? We have one ticket, you guys. I want to fly, Orville. Take me to a mystery island. Okay, so obviously, like, I kind of want to go so we can farm up some iron nuggets. But obviously, I think we should be able to find one villager on this island. So just for funsies, like, let's go and check it out. Let's see if there is a cutie. This is like our first official little villager hunt. <laughs> let's see who it is. Is it a cutie? Is it a tragic villager? This will set the tone for our future villager hunts. Ooh, it's raining. Who is the first mystery island villager? <gasps> okay. 
I mean, Bianca, Bianca's like, okay. She's okay. But definitely not someone we would like to invite. Okay, so, eh, you know, she's all right. Yes, give me all the iron nuggets. Okay, I think I'm gonna quickly like farm up this mystery island. Okay, so we have 24 iron nuggets. That is literally so annoying. We are missing like six. So I'm kind of considering maybe dropping off some iron nuggets from my other island. I did kind of farm up this island as much as I could, but yeah, because I don't have the ladder yet, I cannot like climb to the little cliff that has like one more rock, of course. So yeah, I'm kind of thinking, what should I do here? Like, like in a way, I don't want to quote unquote cheat. So I would like to do as much as I can without the help of my other island. <laughs> but let's see. I don't know. What do you guys think of Bianca? I did not, by the way, invite her, obviously. Okay, I think for the time being, I'm just gonna be like catching some bugs, maybe donating them to blathers, do some fishing, maybe gather some more materials, do all that cozy kind of grindy stuff. And yeah, I have to really think about getting some iron nuggets from maybe from my other island. I don't know, I don't know what to do. Okay. Oh my goodness. What is up, Rudy? Yes. Okay. Rudy wants to help us. Yes. This is what we needed. This is what we needed. Oh my goodness. Okay. So let's address the elephant in the room. Yes. It was actually the next day now. <laughs> I had to go to work. So I couldn't really finish what we started. Um, like literally one minute ago, but you know, like in real life, I went to work in between these two scenes. So yeah, it's officially the next day actually right now. And yeah, I couldn't finish my Nook's Cranny quest yesterday, but I think right now, no way. <laughs> We're literally missing one iron nugget. Okay, so yeah, it's officially the next day. We couldn't get our 30 iron nuggets together in one day, so. <laughs> Here we are again, we didn't progress, we kind of, I don't want to say wasted one day because I want to take things slow, like I honestly don't mind, like I don't want to speed run through the beginning, so we're, we're still doing quite okay, but yeah, anyways, like obviously, I think if you want to progress faster in the game, you probably want to get like all the iron nuggets in one day, so maybe you do wanna go to a friend's island and get some iron nuggets or something but i'm not in a rush so here we are this is technically day four on the island right now so yeah that happened yes these are for you all the iron nuggets that we could get together in like two days oh my goodness okay we have the shop tent to set up or I don't think it's actually a tent. We have to, we have to <laughs> place down our shop. But yeah, I think my first time playing Animal Crossing, obviously I think everyone struggles getting these 30 iron nuggets together if, if you don't have like a second island or like a discord community where you can get like a little bit of help. So I think on my first time playing Animal Crossing, I actually grinded enough miles to get like a second Nook Mile ticket so I could go on another mystery island and get like more iron nuggets that way. But obviously, like if you have a friend who plays or maybe another Switch and another island like us crazy people, um, yeah, you can obviously help yourself out and kind of get more things done in day three. Oh my goodness, I'm not sure where I want to put the shop. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe I kind of want to put the shop somewhere here. Obviously, we might have to like re relocate some of this stuff, but I think for now, I think this could be the spot. 
I already think I have to relocate this one. Where do I want to put the bridge? Actually, that would have been like the perfect spot for the bridge. Oh, but I think, I think this might fit a bridge. Okay. If that fits a bridge, that's good because I think that one looks like a bridge spot. Anyway, <laughs> already making mistakes. Okay, I'm, I think I'm gonna move it. <laughs> I hope it didn't save yet. <laughs> okay, let's do this again. So I think just in case we want to put a bridge here. We might have to put the shop. I'm just gonna check that there is no item in that tree because it's about to be demolished. Okay, I think that's it for now. I mean, we can obviously move it later on. Okie dokies. So yeah. We have our shop placed down. Let's see if there was anything else that we can do. You put up the shop construction kit. We're going to open by tomorrow. I can't wait. Awesome. Also, I just realized that we totally missed out on the Gulliver guest quest because yeah, this is like the next day in game. And I forgot to like dig up his communicator parts, so I don't know how he got off this island. But he somehow did. <laughs> I did see that Sahara is like around here. Yes, what do you have for us? Let's see what kind of rugs she's selling. Definitely gonna get one of each size. Let's make our home a little bit prettier. Okay, well, that's not the vibe right now, but thank you. And that is also not the vibe. Okay. <laughs> Let's pop these. Oh. Oh, that's actually really cool, but also not the vibe. So, put these. Storage. Oh, the brown one is okay, actually. I think the brown one actually goes with the yellow vibe that we have right now. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Okay, so that is our progress so far. I know it's not a lot, but as I've said a million times, I'm really just enjoying taking my time and progressing very, very slowly. Let me know in the comments what you thought of our first Mystery Island Villager. And yeah, if you have restarted your island recently, how is your progress going? What villagers do you have on your island so far? Yeah, I think in the next episode, I'm gonna probably reveal a bit more of my plans for this island. But for this first one, I just wanted to take things slow, just enjoy the relaxing good old animal crossing crossings <laughs> i just want to thank you for watching today's episode make sure that you give this video a big thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss out on more cinnamon island shenanigans things are just gonna get more interesting from now on yeah we're gonna get to those villager hunts very very soon <laughs> and i have a lot of things planned in that area so yeah i think that is it from me you guys i wish i would have some reactions but i don't i hope to see you all in my next video bye guys when are we gonna get the plots i don't remember i don't remember anything <laughs> from the beginning of the game like i forgot everything i always do though like i restart my island so rarely